Oh, what up YouTube? It's been a minute since I vlogged. Just want to give everybody a shout out. Last night was a really, really awesome night. Literally just got done setting down and last night was just really awesome. The vibes were great. People who came through, I want to give a shout out to all of you guys who came through and stuck it out till 5 in the morning. Yo, and I want to give a special shout out to Autolid. Thank you so much for coming by. Shout out to you and your bro. I appreciate you guys very much. You are a real one. Next time, anything, you need any help with anything, let me know. This golf. Found it. Found it. How does this approach feel? Does it feel different than a phone? Today, rough day already, rough patch. I'm editing on the new software here. Not new software, but it's my first time editing on the iMac. So, I, I don't know how it works, I'm trying to learn. So, whatever I edit here in this vlog, then you guys are a part of the editing. So, guess what I got back? This guy. Yeah, he is in the kennel now, unfortunately. Only because while I'm away, he starts to eat things that he's not supposed to eat. Such as my power cords and my <clears throat> shoes, the bed, things like that. He likes to eat those things, so that's why I'm telling him to stay in the kennel, big dog. So I just washed him a while ago in the bathtub. He really needed a wash. It was super dirty. I want to let everybody know that I am hiring for Yazi's Yard Care Services. Please hit me up if you guys are interested and if you live in Albuquerque, New Mexico, I am hiring, all right? So hit me up at your earliest convenience and let's, let's get this money, big dog. Everybody needs a lunch time. Believe it or not, I need a fucking lunch time. It is literally 104 degrees out here. I did go a little too far. Uh, let me see. I went a little too far south. I am looking for ever. In case y'all need to donate some plasma. The man, these people are actually waiting on the bus and it's freaking 99 degrees outside. But, ooh, fuck. I missed the turn off by like a mile, bro. I need to go back to where I literally just turned from. Shit, my teeth are fucking disgusting. Do you guys like the quality of the camera? I like it a lot better. Come on, let's go. Shred it. I am bored out my mind, dog. Clear. Oh, hell no. Look at that. I'm clear on that side, but I am definitely not cleared on this side. Okay, come on. 
go, go, go. Dang, dang, daddy. Fire. Nobody coming out, nobody coming in. Really good evening. I ate some dinner. I literally had two slabs of steak. It was delicious. I wanted to show you guys this box that I have. It's um it's a really nice cigar box. Only problem with it is broken back here, so this past weekend on the way back home, I was able to get a deal with this guy because usually they sell their cigars and they keep the boxes and keep refilling it and I don't know what they what else they do with the cigar boxes. But this past weekend, I asked the guy, I said, hey, um, if I buy all these cigars here, can I get the box along with it? And he said, oh yeah, yeah, let's do it. So um, I bought all the cigars that he had. He had about three of them left in the case. And then I just tell, I asked him politely if I could buy it, and he said, yeah. And then I said, can I take the box with it? And he said, yes. So, and the feeling of it is just like, it's really relaxing and really calming. Yeah. Obviously they're not meant to inhale, so they'll be like, super inhaling it. It's not a blunt, okay? It's a cigar. It's just a cigar, so don't inhale it like a blunt. Something about it, super classy and it's super um, therapeutic. It's super classy, super therapeutic. Feels good. So, it's not a cig cigarette. Cigarettes filled with chemicals. Cigars, natural tobacco. Natural wrap their leaves. Yeah, it's pretty badass. <laughs>